All right, Shield Bros, welcome back to the next episode of our Red Dead Redemption 2 playthrough. We are picking up right where we left off on Tuesday. We are riding with Rain Falls. Last episode, we saw the death of Cole Muldrisgul. I'm very sorry. It's all for that. I did everything I could. I know, Captain. And I assure you, I will continue to do as much as I can. Mr. Morgan, would you have time to help me at all? Yeah, I could help you, I guess. I don't know. Were taken by friends outside the tribe. Yeah. Oh, I can help. That's good news. Thank you. Come meet me on the reservation whenever you can. Okay. Any assistance would be much appreciated, Mr. Morgan. Yeah, good boy. Coming through. Permanent. <laughs> Anyway, gentlemen, I won't take up any more of your time. Bye, Mr. Er, sorry, Captain Monroe. Thank you, Captain. Enjoy the ride. We'll continue on this way. I'm going to look for some herbs to give you. I think the chief went the other way, sir. No, nope, he's right here. Coming past. Okay, sir. Go. I have some other business to attend to, Mr. Morgan. Goodbye. Feasting on that horse? Yeah. Brutality and beauty are both all around us. Yet so often we're unable to see past our own grievances. This is what I try to teach my son. That is actually some cool advice. Yeah. Yeah. Go on, get out. Good. There was no need to harm them. Yeah. Yeah. If you want, Mr. Morgan, but don't feel like you have to. It's a beautiful ride ahead if you need some time to think. So, we don't know each other too well, but I wanted to speak to you about your son. I was there on the raid to steal back those horses, and, uh, well. You know something of Dutch, I think. Yes, a little. Mostly from your friend Charles. I don't know why Dutch is getting involved in your situation, and this ain't easy to say, but I just don't trust that he's got your son's best interests at heart. So what can we do? I don't rightly know. Charles and I just thought you should be aware. Maybe. There's a way to stop things from getting any more out of control. Thank you, Mr. Morgan. Let me give this some thought. Whoa, hold up a moment. Some of the plants I need will be growing down here. Okay, bet. Thank you. Mace. Let's continue on. Let us go then. You know, I had a son once, years ago. I want to hear him talk, talk about, about this. Much. Yeah, he's no never talked about it. Isaac. His mother, Eliza, the waitress I met. When she got pregnant, she, she knew who I was, what my life was. I didn't want to promise nothing I couldn't keep, but I said I'd do right by them. Every few months, I'd stop by there for a few days. He was such a good kid. Damn. She was too, I guess. <laughs> Just a kid, 19. What happened? I got there one day, 
Saw two crosses outside. I knew right away. Turned out some bastards had come through. Robbed them and shot them dead. No! Oh, for $10. Harden me. Feeling that kind of pain. But I know now. Wait, stop here. I want to pick some ginseng. Wow, we you can kind of interrupted me there, bud. Reader. Oh, rude. <laughs> Whoa, that view, though. Holy cow. This will combine well. Good job. Wait there. I'll put these in your saddlebag. Okay. Mix these together. It tastes awful. But it'll help to keep your strength up. Well, I mean, that's a good trade-off. All right, let's go. It's not much further now. Now, I was saying, but I know now that... You don't get to live yeah. a bad life and have good things happen to you. Watch out! Oh, sorry. I think you're being hard on yourself. Maybe. All I can do now is try and make some things right. The Night Feller. Monroe, how you know him? Captain Monroe was reassigned here from a regiment in the north. Apparently, the news of our conflict oh? has spread all the way to Washington. Oh. He's a good man. He wants to help. Well, I guess that's something, at least. The army aren't all bad men. Just as my people aren't all good. But this Colonel Favors, he walks an old line. He's obstinate, and he hates Monroe. Ah. I just hope between us we can work this out. Oh, we're cold. I didn't realize. Can I not mix them together yet? Okay. It's just up ahead. Alright, I guess we're done talking now. It won't give me any other options. What's happened? No! Oh, we rode past this. It can't be. To find the Chinupa. Who, who would do this? Someone who wanted to enrage you. Maybe Dutch did it. Help me look around, please. The Chinupa is gone. Of course. What is it? A uh, ceremonial pipe. There must be some clues to what happened here. Let's look. There's some whiskey here. This is a place of peace. <laughs> Take the bourbon. What reason would they have? 
I don't know. Let's try and find out. It's ruined. Oh, there's a skeleton. Empty bottle of whiskey. Well, if they drank all that, they couldn't have gotten too far. Yeah, well, still no sign of the Chinupa. Let's see if we can find it. Oh, a flask. I cannot believe this. Army flask. It sure looks like they was doing some drinking. Okay, let's continue on. Look there, smoke. I'm coming. Do you have any binoculars? Oh, no. Oh, there they are. These. Brave men. Oh, we rode by this camp. Some of Colonel Favor's men. They must have been the ones who did this. Are you surprised this happened? Not at all. But but I hope we were past this. Well, you got land they want. Land with oil. Yeah. And money talks. They moved Especially things here. like oil. They've taken everything we had. I signed three treaties myself, and they've broken each one. Now they've taken the last hope. Now my people are going to want a war. A war they can't win. I don't... I'm sorry, Rainsfall. Not if I get it back. Get it back? Yep. Yeah, I'm gonna go in. Oh, my God. Damn. Come here. Come on, boy. Let's see. There we go. If you could do this for me. I would very much appreciate it. All right, boy. Are you not going down there? I am. Here we go, we're gonna use this ledge. All right, shield bros. Well, I can't hit anything right now. Oh, there we go. Let's 
Is that not what he wanted? Document. Oh. Oh, okay. Cool. That's fine. Oh, actually. All right. Everyone dead. Yeah. I mean, it's not like they were going to give it to me. Oh, there it is. Sacred items. All right. There we go. Okay, boy. All right, boy. Yeah. There, boy. Up we go. Here you go. You found it. I did. Here. I uh, I got your things, I, I think. Yes. Thank you. I'm very sorry about this. Even sacred things God. are only things. People, the heart matter more. Was anyone hurt? Yes. It's a bad business. I should not have let you do this for me, but perhaps it will stop a bigger massacre. With these, maybe I can calm my people. Maybe I can calm my son. I hope so. Thank you. I really hope so. Take those herbs I gave you, please. And most of all, I hope you can find peace within yourself. Thank you, Rain's Fall. He's a man who, not so long ago, I would have found weak and pathetic. Now I see his wise. And thoughtful and sensible. And I would love to help him. Yeah. Or at least stop Dutch pushing his son to do something real stupid. Well, now we got a couple options. Eagle flies. Captain Monroe, John Marston. I don't know.
I guess we'll go do the John one, go blow up the bridge. In the next episode, we can help Captain Monroe at the reservation. All right. Let's go find John. Yep. Yeah. Get him. All right. We've talked to Rainfalls. We've you know, got help with him, helped him. Oh, J. John Weathers is up here. Oh, well, since we're here. J. John Weathers. They call me Snow Goose now. Whatever they call you. You borrowed money. Off of Leopold Strauss. The bills come due. This ain't the best time, sir. This ain't the best time for anyone. Mr. Strauss knew it was a long-term proposition. The debt is due. Okay. I got supplies meant to last through the winter. You can take them. Just, is there any way you can help me? I stay out here. There won't be anyone to pay you. I ain't here to help. I'm here to collect. We're all, all of us up against it. Look, there's men after me. <laughs> there's men after everybody. I ain't a deserter, just an Come objector. Come on now. It ain't right. If there was another way than running, I need your help. Shut up. Please. I... Up here, it's him. It's too no. late. No! I clear off, sir. Ah, shit. Well, seeing as I'm here, I'm, I'll do what I can for you. Oh, Lord Shieldbirds, okay. Oh! That's a lot of dead soldier boys. He did. All right. Oh, his wagon's on fire. No. It's all right, my darling. You can come out. Oh. We are not taking anything from this man. Helped you fix the damn wagon. We could probably still save something. Really now? Look, you can take the silver locket for the debt. I reabsolve you. Damn the debt. Just get her somewhere safe. Go on. Thank you, fella. You know there ain't enough kindness in this world, that's for sure. But you. I don't know nothing about kindness. It's, I don't feel kindness right now. I just feel pity. And absolved. All right, let's keep going. Let's go see John. All right, boy. Yeah, good boy. Careful now. All right. Oh, we're going the wrong way. That way! The bad about his wagon. Yep. You're alright, boy. There we go. Hey, man. 
Here we go. Onward we go. Okay. Onward we go. Onward we go. Okay, sorry, uh, my bad. Yeah. Cleared out the camp. I think we're almost there now. Yep. Hey, there's John. Marston. I had a lot of time to think in that jail, and I feel like I just don't know Dutch no more. You ain't the only one. And this plan to get us out, it just feels... I don't know. Like he's stringing us along, I know. Killing in cold blood, revenge, we all do bad things, but he seems to enjoy it now. It's like he just wants to create more enemies. More chaos. Yeah, I know. I mean, I love Dutch. He saved me a long time ago. Yeah. I feel like hey, he both saved of me us. when I got arrested. Maybe he could have done something. I feel like you should take your woman and child and get lost. Do you? You can. You could give something to Jack. Hey, Stider. Well, I don't see no way out of this. Well, what about loyalty? Be loyal to what matters. What are you gonna do? <laughs> I'll be okay, but do it for me. It would make me feel good, if that makes any sense. A little, but... Listen to me. When the time comes, you gotta run and don't look back. This is over. Damn. And now? Now we gotta... Help Dutch give the army one final tweak on its nose. <laughs> yeah, come on. Help me with the rest of this. <sighs> well, oh, damn. Like we finally found our call I like that he's telling John to get out of here. Shield Bros, it's, it, it's nice to see. this thing out onto the bridge. There's a spot about a third of the way across where we can get down underneath and plant the charges. We've already set up the detonator. There we go. John, let's get this over with. You hear about Dutch and Cornwall? Yeah. This is what I'm talking about. Come on. More, enemies, more chaos. I mean, we're about to blow up a bridge for Christ's sake. What the? Come on. <clears throat> All right. We sure got a lot of this stuff. Oh yeah, we got a lot of dynamite. I'll climb down there. You lower the crates. All right. All right. Let me know when you're ready. Whatever you say, John. Got Whatever it. you say. Ready when you are. I'm at the bottom of the ladder here to your left. There's good. Lower it down. No, more to your right. Here you go. I'm ready. Come on. All right, take 
<laughs> yeah. Nearly there. Okay, good. Grab the other one. Will do. Grab that. Here you go. There you go. One hand after the other. Got it. All right, come down here and help me plant this stuff. All right, I'm coming. What are you doing up there? I'm coming, John. I'm coming. Okay. Grab Just wait. Bundle from the box. Oh Lord. Okay. The bridge is wired to the detonator. We need to attach each of those bundles to the fuses. There's one on each of the main support beams. Okay. okay. I sure hope this is enough to blow it. These are mine in charge. They ain't easy to come by. If they don't do the job, nothing will. There we go. Plant the dynamite. And one more. Okay. I should go get the hand cart ready. You okay to finish off down there? Sure. Go on. I can handle the rest. I see you up there. This better work. All right. There we go. Land it. And then we can get the hell out of here. Shit. I think I hear something coming, Arthur. Oh, Lord. Oh. Come on. Pump this stupid thing as hard as you can. Come on. Come on. Come on. <laughs> Sticky keys. There we go. Okay. Sticky keys will throw me off, but we got it. <laughs> Come on. Let's go blow this thing up. Let's do it. Um, I think the line held. You want the honors? Sure. Here we go. Blow it sky high. Oh my god! <laughs> well, it worked. Well, I guess old Dutch got all the smoke he wants. Well, let's hope so. You really think that that'll draw attention away from us? I guess we'll see. To tell the truth, I ain't even sure I fully understand Dutch's plan with all this. Like I said, John, when the time comes, you go. What about yeah, get the hell out of here. To, to everything. You been loyal. I've been loyal. Look what that cost. You know all that ever mattered to me was loyalty. It was all I knew. It's all I ever believed in. Well, not anymore, John. Dang. Soon, you gotta go. Go. But don't 
look back. I'll think about it. I've done a lot of thinking. Look at us. Out here risking our necks and for what exactly? For an idea that don't work no more. How you mean? You know just what I mean. You got a family. You need cash. You need to start building a life for yourself. Me? I need a vacation. And Dutch has all the money for safekeeping. You know something? Abigail thinks she might know where some of that money is. Well, you tell her she better make sure. And then come talk to me. Oh, heck yes. And we'll find out just who and what we should be loyal to. Yes. I don't know, Arthur. Nor do I. I don't trust I Dutch anymore. More clearly now. They deserve I to be free. Were different. But it weren't us who changed. Yeah. Yeah. Good, Arthur. <laughs> I can't get, I can't move. There we go. Where we were supposed to... Shield Bros, I think we're at a good stopping point. So next time we will go help Captain Monroe and continue our adventure with the Native Americans. And then we will go see Dutch and Eagle Flies. Hopefully we can persuade Eagle Flies not to do anything crazy and maybe we can get Dutch to stop being crazy. One can dream, Shield Bros. But it was a good episode today. We got a lot done. We had a lot of interactions. It was very interesting. I hope you enjoyed. If you did, please make sure you hit that like and subscribe button for me. If you ever have a comment, suggestion, or concern, simply drop that in the comment section down below for me and I'll get back to you because I do read all of your comments. If you would ever like to support me further, check out the links in the description of my video from my Discord to my Twitter. It's got everything there. You can go check that out. But that's enough for me for today. If you ever miss part of any of the playthroughs, make sure you check out the playlists. And until next time, as always, I am Shieldbro6 for the Gaming Armada. And I'll catch y'all next time. Yeehaw!